Bitcoin stabilizes at 67k. The SEC is probing crypto companies in Ethereum. And what in the F happened to our beloved 99 Bitcoins channel? A god ball. Ours. Just the last story, not more, this week in crypto. Hi, I'm not Nate Morton from 99bitcoins.com and I take that personally. Let's look at the damage. Since a bit more than a week, 99bitcoins has started uploading generic low effort content, clickbait thumbnails, AI images, and a Mr. Beast face cut out if Mr. Beast got his teeth removed for better suction. To add insult to injury, the video starts with welcome to another 99bitcoins video. It's not. We're watching Jacob Cryptobury, and that's why you're watching Discount Coffeezilla now. Jacob is yet another crypto shiller. Nothing wrong with the grind, I mean, my channel. Problem is, this is 99 bitcoins, or it was. Dude has a website chilling a newsletter which doesn't chill. It's act it actually just teaches crypto. Design is outdated, but the videos were a fresh breath of air. All of it was. Facebook, the Twitter, the blog. It was good learning content and snappy, consistent, void of any of the usual desperate money grabbing. It was nice. And now we have Jacob. So Jacob sells. The very first line of his video description is a literal meme coin. The second one is another meme coin. The third one is trading signals. And the fourth one is a paywall discord. You know, where you pay to become a member, a full fledged member. Bait title, repeat for that SEO juice, software shilling and so on and so on. God forbid we get timestamps, explanations or a snappy experience. To hell with that. Where's the bathwater 2.0 token? I need my daily dose of Shil Delphine. Okay, let's jump back into the hostage situation. In his newest video, he takes out what feels like 10 hours to say Google Trends to pick up what token is popular as a method. Well, if I knew the name beforehand, I could. But how do we find that out early, Jacob? Well, you don't. Apparently, you go for dead coins, wait for a while, you get it. The strategy is rubbish. No, it's not that bad. His explanations are fine, but it's the same stuff everyone is doing. We have thousands of these on YouTube. Nothing. Not even a hint of a hint of something new here. No new approach, no better production value, nothing. It's like that street that has a Burger King and a McDonald's. And Jacob is like, oh, do you see that family-owned restaurant with steaks over there? Let's turn that into a Wendy's. Really gotta have one of that right here. This one hurts. Because most likely 99 bitcoins is retired. It's dead. In my four seconds of research, I couldn't find anything. If the channel got sold, if Jacob is the nephew, who knows? Your bet is as good as mine. But the usual week has passed and my hopes of this just being mixed in are now gone. Because our summary videos are too. So, rest in peace, Nate. So that's it. 99 Bitcoins is now a second channel of this Jacob guy, where he rehashes the videos he already makes for his main channels, alters it so YouTube doesn't punish it as a copy, and same stuff everyone sells. So yeah, that's it. Rest in peace, Nate. Subscribe to my only